Hey everyone, Isaac here from Brooklyn Kayak Company. I'm excited to be standing in front of our brand new 13.0 tandem paddle kayak. This is replacing the TK122 and has a lot of new features that I'm gonna run down with you today. This kayak is 12 foot nine inches in length. It has a super stable platform of 34 and a quarter inches wide. It only weighs 85 pounds and has a maximum weight capacity of a whopping 800 pounds. Let me run you down some of the features starting from the top here. You have your molded in front handle, which is really wide, you get a really good grip on it. This kayak is not going anywhere, whether you're pulling it through the surf, through the river, moving forward here. Great feature we changed on this kayak and made a lot more room for your platform is these adjustable footrests. They adjust at almost any position, simply adjust and lock into place. So there's a lot more platform area for standing. You have your rectangle storage hatch. Again, these are dry storage hatches, but as we always recommend, if you're going out with anything valuable, your keys, your cell phone, keep it in a, an additional dry storage hatch, in the dry storage bag. As you can see here, I just pulled out of that dry storage hatch, the included articulating rod holder. That'll mount up front here. Simply find the position to drop it in place, twist it, the desired location and drop it in. A really nice feature we added this year is like a small little tackle storage area right in front of the rectangle hatch. So you could drop things that you're working with like lures, sinkers, maybe even some cut up bait, anything you might have you want to just have at hand. And it has little drainage ports just so water won't build up. All of our kayaks are self bailing, which means if you pull the scupper plugs out, which there are eight scupper plugs in the cockpit of, these, of this kayak, the water will drain out, even if you're sitting in the water. Each kayak pit has uh, accessory rails on each side. These are for mounting things like cup holders, rod holders, anything you could think of that you'd want to attach to a kayak. They make them in what they call an accessory rail mounting hardware. So just keep your eye out for that, and you'll never have to drill a hole in your kayak again. These pro kayaks do come with the aluminum frame upright seats. These seats are equipped with the quick dry mesh material for a super dry, comfortable all day ride. A uh, great feature we added this year are two seating positions. Right now the seat is in its lowered paddling position. You could also lift it up and it'll be in its perched position. This is for when you want to get a better vantage point, whether you're fishing, bird watching, Anywhere you wanted to get a better vantage point, you'd, you'd lift the seat up into this position right here. Further on the side of the seat, you have a plastic tackle storage area. So you'll put your storage box there and you'll just wrap it up in this bungee cord and lock it in place. Each passenger gets two flush mounted rod holders. You got two behind each rider. This model also comes with, the Pro models come with the Fiberglass KP225 paddle. These paddles are fully adjustable, up to 90 inches in length and any type of flare that you could desire. It's two paddle park systems on each side handle. You just drop it right down and lock the paddle in place while you're fishing. These side handles are ergonomic with comfort grip uh, underneath. Again, you have your bungee tie down on that side as well. And one great thing that we did with the this year's model is there's no dividing space between the front passenger and the rear passenger. So if you're going out solo and you wanted to put your cooler in front of you, or if you wanted to just leave this as an open standing platform, you'll see here a lot of space to do that. Again, the rear cockpit, you have your adjustable footrests, you have your tackle storage area. You are gonna have a little bit more space back here in the rear cockpit, just a little wider. Again, you have your dry hatch area with the red bag. Accessory rails on each side, your height adjustable seat, your tackle tray storage. Each passenger gets a cup holder and your two flush mounted rod holders in the rear with the flaps. And this is all self bailings, meaning so even the rear storage area is going to have scuppers that you could pull out and drain the water out. Rear storage area is big enough for a 20 liter cooler, fishing crate comes with uh, the bungee tie down system so you can keep your belongings secure. In the rear you have a comfort grip T handle. Also we made a nice under grip handle so there's just somewhere to grab underneath when you're launching it. Further if you were to get any water in one of the hatches which is the only where water should be coming in from then you'd have an, uh, a drain area here to drain any water that might have gotten inside. 
Well, that's everything I have to show you about the 13.0. Thank you for watching and hope to see you out on the water.